John King for the sprawl, post weigh-in with Cage where he's title challenging Nadan Aramani. Um, second, you know, second time you're fighting with a title tomorrow. How was the wake-up come first of all? Because obviously it's, it's quite good to get down to 145. How's that been? Yeah, it's alright. It's, uh, I'm used to it now, but um, it's never nice. But um, yeah. it's done now and that's that out of the way. And now it's on to the, you know, the good part, you know, the fighting. So, um, yeah, let's uh, come up here to get it done. Yeah. You're obviously in, in Paddy's hometown, it's going to be a, a massive crowd cheering one. Is that going to affect you at all? No, not at all. You know, I'm, in there, I'm in there with Paddy and the referee and that's, that's how I see it. I don't even hear the crowd when I fight, yeah. you know, uh, so uh, that's not going to affect me, no. Yeah. What did you make of Paddy at the weigh-in? Because um, his last few fights he's had a very tough weigh-in, weigh, weigh cut. This time he looked a little bit better, but obviously still drawn out, he's massive. What did you make of that? Yeah, I mean, same as everyone, you know what I mean? Everyone yeah. looks drawn out of the way and, you know, I look like a crackhead of the way and so everyone, everyone looks drawn out of the way and uh, yeah. it's, it's what it is. Is there a specific game plan going in or is it just whatever happens happens? Uh, yeah, I've got some bits and bobs that I want to work, um, yeah. but I always just go in to fight, you know, so um, that's what I'm going to do. Yeah. Obviously, uh, Paddy's last performance was one of his worst. Um, I obviously, had a tough weight cut. Um, everything went wrong for him, and he ends up just edging Julian Rosa. Did you take a lot from that, or, or do you consider that just a bad night at the office? Um, bits and bobs. I look more across the board, you know, across yeah. the, all, all, all fights. Um, I look at patterns. I don't really look at fights. Yeah. I look at how people, how, what people do, and uh, yeah. their patterns of their fighting, you know. Um, so. That's what I looked at, yeah. and that's what I've looked at throughout his, for, all, for all of his fights. Yeah. How much does it mean to you uh, to not only win this fight but to capture the title? You obviously had a fight with Alex Enlander not, not not too long ago, and it was such a close fight, such a hard fought fight, and you you just you know was just just beaten. How much does it mean to win the title? That would be fantastic, isn't it? It's uh, it's one of the biggest promotions in Europe. To win the yeah. title would be great, um, and that's what I've come to do. Yeah. Uh, obviously, going to be a lot of uh, rehydration things like that tonight. Any, any, you know, any foods in mind? Anything like that you're going to eat, or is it just a case? Uh, I've got a little bit of Moroccan that I've brought up from yeah. you know, from Bristol, so uh, I'll be having that as well. Yeah. And then uh, we'll go and find something out in the, out in, out in the town. Yeah. Uh, some Middle Eastern food. Or something I've been do, done most of my camp on some Middle Eastern, so uh, that's what I'll probably carry on with. Yeah. How how's this camp been? Uh, good, good so far. It's been a good camp. It's been very focused. Very. Um, it's been good. It's been. Um, yeah, very good. Definitely. Yeah. And uh, before we go, any any specific predictions for tomorrow night, or just that you have your hand raised? I'll have my hand raised. I'm looking yeah. for the finish. Yeah. If the finish don't come, then I'm gonna I'm gonna grind it out for five rounds. Yeah. So um, I'll be there fighting for five rounds, whatever. If it's a five, if, if I get the finish within that five rounds, I get the finish. Yeah. Um, if not, then I'll be still fighting at the end of the at the end of the, uh, the uh, fifth round. Yeah. Now, good luck. Hey, Thank you very much. Thank Cheers, you. Mate. Yeah, Thanks. Nice.